Hi there and welcome back. If you're new then welcome aboard. Um, this is I think the third video um, I've done on uh, pages, different uh, page ideas. So this is going to be uh, the last one in uh, doing some different types of pages. So here I've got uh, two pages what are joined together. Okay, I've got one what's a little bit more interesting in my opinion than uh, the other. In fact, I think I'm going to do that that way. Okay, so let's um <coughs> let's move my pile to one side and work on uh one at a time so two full pages if they're not joined then you can obviously join them and you know we've done we've done that before i'm going to put the planer one in front so i'm going to need to join these together okay so first i'm going to get the size just grab a pencil okay and just tear tear that off okay and then I'm gonna glue this completely I think oh, is it too might be a little bit uh, too wide. Let's um, let's just tear it down a bit. This is just a strip what's left over from when I've um, you know cut pages down for for something else. Yeah, that's probably probably better. Um, I'm gonna ink around the perimeter. In fact, I think I'll stamp down it as well, just just so it looks. Um, you know a bit more a bit more interesting i've used paper instead of card because this bit will be uh well it'll be in the middle of the signature so it'll be um sewn in so i don't want to add we don't, oh, i don't want to add any extra um bulk i mean we add an extra bulk whatever but um you know keep it as as thin as possible so that's made it a little bit more <clears throat> um interesting so let's um glue this making sure that um i do get the edges as soon as i say edges <laughs> i tend to like go go towards the center uh, pressure <laughs> to get in the edge Oh, it's um, a warm day today. We've had a lot of rain over the last few weeks, but um, the sun is back out. Just as um, I've put a sweatshirt on, um, yeah, the sun, the sun has decided to come out. So I'm going to put that um, about halfway, like so. And then I'm going to put that on halfway like so just gonna leave a little tiny uh gap you know nothing to speak of just a hair um so it folds folds nicely okay i'll leave that a second um i shall trim trim that down now i don't think i'll need to put another strip down here but you know I could I could if I needed to okay so now we've made you know four four pages okay let's bring it together and fold it fold it down did I find my um, bone folder there it is Okay, so I'll just give it a good, a good squash down. Then what I thought is, like an altered uh, book that you would make a pocket with the actual page. So I folded that down. 
and then I'm going to glue uh, that down. So I'm, I'm going to take this off because at some point I will be putting some paper over the top so um, that will make the pocket um, more sturdy. Let's just cut, cut that off. So it didn't have to be a corner one. I could have, um, you know, brought it round like that um, and had, you know, that on the on the back. That could have been a pocket, could have been a tuck. So, but I do like a, a corner pocket. So I'm going to put glue down this little side and across there across the bottom like so. Let's stick that down. Let's just cut this down a bit, a bit more. That's it. Okay, so now this will be one side of his signature. Let me get my page. <coughs> so that will be one side. And we'll have another page and then we'll have this uh, double page here okay so that is is that one obviously we'll put that in the um do, 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 the thing to be um decorated i'll just ink ink around here i should have inked that bit I can just just pull it out. That's it. Lovely. I'll link it, you know, all over when when I come to decorate. So that's that one. I like that. Yeah. And I mean, you know, I could have put another another pocket in if I'd have wanted. Um, here. Do I want to? I kind of like this page though. So no, I'm not going to. But yeah, you definitely could. So that's the, the first one. Okay, I'll keep that bit of paper. So what have we got next? I've got another quite interesting uh Piece. These are from uh, Denise at Junk Journal uh, UK. She was selling some uh, book page packs. So, and I've got another one, which is a book uh, Denise actually sent me. This is the front of the front of it. So, I'm just going to tear it down. I'm going to follow. There's a little box uh, around it. I just want to make it uh, a bit smaller. So I'll just follow that around and hopefully get it something something like straight. Okay. Gosh, I'm I'm warm now. <laughs> right, and I'm gonna stick that onto uh here. I think I prefer that side. So oh I must order some more of this uh glue. So hold that, that's it. Take that bit of paper off and I'm just going to pop that down here. I'm going to butt it up to two sides and then I've only got two sides to, to cut and it, you know, uses less paper so you've got less scraps and you've got more left over to back something else with. Okay, so I could have placed it a little bit to the side and left uh, a little bit all around so it could have been a gusseted uh, pocket. But I didn't actually think about that until, until I said it. <laughs> uh, but yeah. Definitely could have been uh, a gusseted pocket. So let's ink around that. I'm going to put um, 
a little thumb hole in. So I'm just looking either side to see if it's something like central and just ink, ink that around. Love that. Okay. And I'm going to glue this down uh, three sides. So the sides and across the bottom. Obviously you can make all different types of, of pockets. So I'm going to pop that just above there because I like that bit at the bottom that says uh, London John Hogg 13 Peter Noster Row EC okay and then pop that down I might have been best doing a, a side one so it's going to have to be a tag that's not much bigger than the pocket okay so now we've got a book page pocket on top of uh, the book page and I absolutely love um, that so I don't know what else I'm, I'm doing I mean I probably will put a, another pocket or something um, on it but um, I've been saving that um, sheet with the signatures on um, I, I did have some other ones and I did you know rip them down and use the um, signatures separately but um, yeah, I thought it'd be nice to, to keep them together. It's quite wonky, <laughs> honestly. I am so rubbish at not, uh, not being wonky. So that's that one. Let's just check that we've not stuck anywhere, apart from where we should be. Okay, so that's that one. So we've done two. Now, <laughs> I've got um, some ledger. And I'm going to get that down to the size um, I want it for my journal. I'll go to to there. Oh, let's make sure that that fits. No, it's a little bit big, so I'll have to take some of that off as well. So that one's going back in my um, tub. Let's put that behind. I think Colin's going to start barking because another dog's barking on the on the street. Okay, so that's going to be too wide, isn't it? I don't really want to cut it off. So I could do like what I did last time and make a new um, crease. So let's. Let's do that. Let's just check it out. And then I'll bring this one in like so. Okay, so we've got a new a new sheet and I'm gonna attach this one to it. So I'm gonna fold it down. You could definitely use um, your scoreboard okay folded that down then I'm going to glue I think that's a little bit still too big but I can uh, trim it trim it off so I'm going to glue that down. I've obviously creased it so that you can uh, turn, uh, turn it. Yeah, like turning a page. That'll be okay. So, oh, I don't want it right to the edge, do I? Because I've got to think that will be saying in the signature. So I could do it. I want it there. No, I'm gonna do it 
do here so i've just brought it out um a little a little bit and i don't think that's straight but nobody's nobody's shocked <laughs> shocked by by that okay and then i can cut cut that bit off the bottom I'll just rub it, rub it down to make sure that it's connected. So we've got that, which is obviously a right in uh, spot. Um, <clears throat> and I was just going to pop um, a couple of brads through there, just for something uh, to look at, really. Now, they aren't brads, but they're... I don't, I'm not so keen on the bright ones, but I could put those on. Let's see if I can poke those um, through. I can't remember where where I got these from. I don't I don't know what they're called. Okay, so. Okay, sorry about that. Um, my memory had not. Yeah, my memory was full on the on the phone. Okay, so pop that in and turn it around. Now I'm just going to get my uh, all and give it a good uh, flatten down. So it's as flat as can be. And then I've got these um, strips. These are from one of the um, Tim Holtz uh, papers. And I think I'll cut off, I think I'll cut off the, the map one and just put that over. Oh, I don't want those scissors. They're my um, material scissors. Okay, I think these strips are in the French industrial um, papers. Okay. some tape over it and perhaps uh, done a side uh, tuck over the top I would have um, still had to cover over because if you was putting a card in in there you wouldn't want them to get to get trapped um, but yeah I could definitely make it make it into something I don't want to put it over the crease. Give that a good, good press down. And it just needs trimming. Slightly. Let's just ink. Ink that top again. <coughs> Okay, so that's that's another one. A little bit different. Okay, so that's the third the third one. Right, what have we got next? Um, oh yeah. 
so this is obviously from a music box and at first i was going to rip um this out and use it because i thought how, how lovely um is that and then it was attached to here and i thought well i've already got three pages here so i may as well keep them keep them together okay I can go in collage so they're obviously too wide so I think I could I could make that into a big pocket and just make this into a two one how much would that have to come off from there <laughs> or do I just want to keep it as pages Let me just just fold it down in that. So that's how wide it wants to be. Yeah, I can't make my mind up if I still want to make it into th three. So I could glue that down, couldn't I? And that would be a pocket and it would still be a page. So let's do that um, with, with that. Okay, and this is a uh, thick music paper, so I don't need to back uh, the pocket. And I'll probably put some, um, I don't think I'll totally cover it with paper, but um, yeah, I'll probably put some uh, paper over it. So we've got a side uh, tuck or pocket there. So... I wish I'd have done it in a bit more, actually. It's going to be two. I'm just going to bend this up a little bit more. Okay. And it's not going to have any glue there, is it? Is that even straight? Yeah, you look straight. Right, I don't think it's stuck anyway, so... That's, um, you'll see why in a second. Um, I'd kind of not thought fully uh, what I wanted to do with it. You might have guessed. <laughs> right, so that's a, that's a side um, thing. Obviously, this is going into the um, spine, so it's not the cleverest of... of um, Oh dear, I've lost my words, sorry. Um, yeah, it's not the cleverest place to to have um, a pocket. But I suppose if it only comes out to, to there, the card, it'll be, it'll be fine. Okay, so that's that. And then this one, I'm going to rip off where it needs to be. So actually, it's about there, isn't it? No, it's not. <laughs> no, it's not there. Okay, let's... It's a bit smaller than I wanted it.
yeah, it's still big enough. Okay. <clears throat> so that's just doing it up so we can so we can see it. Okay. Um and that one, I think I'll just turn it that way. And I might add something extra um, to that. Um, you know, another another time. Let me get um, a pencil. So I'm going to mark um, this. Where am I going to mark it? So it's just over eight inches. Or just over 20. So five, 10, 15. Okay, I'm gonna mark it at five centimeters, 10 centimeters, 15 centimeters. I think that's there and I'm gonna put a hole in it I mean, it, it looks nice just with the, just with the holes. And I was going to put the, the big um, highlights in, but I don't know if that'll be too, too much. Oh no, I like that. Where's it on? <laughs> right, let's find... Um, Oh, it's a magnet underneath. I was wondering why the uh, ruler was um, stuck to it. I don't know if there's any black ones. I don't think there is. Choose these brown ones. Brown, brown. It's like a chestnut um, colour. And I'm going to put these in just for decoration just for something um a bit a bit different right what am i doing okay you know what i've not ate this morning i've got no uh cereal bars or bananas uh left in the next hour i'm <clears throat> i'm i've got a doctor's appointment and i'm gonna nip to the supermarket after and um, yeah, I think that's why I'm a bit, um, I mean, I'm not saying I'm not normally uh, dizzy, uh, but <laughs> yeah, I think I'm even more so um, today. And I think it is because I've not had, I feel quite, um, sad. Yeah, I like that. Now, originally, I was going to thread some uh, ribbon down it. And we've done that before. We've done it on tags. Um, and I've done it on something else. Can't remember what. But um, I like that just as it, just as it is. I think that's, um, I think that's nice. And I could obviously um, add a charm on or something um, like, like that. Let's just fold Hold that. That's going to be lovely to to decorate. Could do that as a small. Let's do, do that. <clears throat> I'm going to glue this down because I won't be, uh, you know, covering this paper, and it's not thin, but it's um. It's not the thickest, so okay, 
Hopefully that's not too into the thing. Yeah, so that can be a, <coughs> a tall uh, corner. Well, it's not even a corner pocket, is it? It's just a tall, so like a bookmark um, type. Type of one going, <coughs> going in. So that's that one. Yeah, I love that. Let's just stick stick that down. Oh, I can't stick it down, it's got nothing to stick to. Um washi tape. Let's pop a bit of washi tape on. Could do that. Let's use the clock one because that's got more brown in it. Because I don't know if I'll say I think I'll say that bit in actually. It just falls uh, better. So I'll just put it just to the side of where um, I would sew it in. Okay, I'll just cut that. Try and cut that off. Oof. Yep. <clears throat> so that's that's that one. Right. What else have I got? <clears throat> um, this one. So it's quite interesting page. It's very uh, thin. So. Um, I was gonna move that up like so but first i'm gonna cut um two of these do you want two or three let's cut three in fact i'll do it with the with the ruler okay i think that's okay i've got to just take my glasses off a minute um <clears throat> My eyes are running uncontrollably. Oh. Right. So that's that. I'm going to fold it in half. I'll try to glue all over my fingers. Like so. Okay. Give it a ink, a ink round. So these are going to be uh, pockets. I think I'm a bit close with the camera, so um, you can't where I'm doing things naturally. Um, it looks funny in the in the camera, so I'm gonna pop that there and just mark there, and I'm gonna fold it there. It does make the page quite small, but that's fine. I'd have probably been better using a, a taller uh, page, but I I got my pages out first. Um, you know, I've picked some interesting uh, ones. So, what I'm going to do is, I'm going to glue the middle just to keep it, keep it in place. Yeah, I picked um, some, you know, interesting uh, pages and then um, sat and just thought, what can I do do with them? So I'm just going to fold that that way so I can see um, where, the, where the middle is. So I obviously don't want to go right into the, right into the middle. 
Okay, and I've probably done it a little bit taller than it should. So I'll just have it hanging uh, down a little bit. Okay. So I'm going to completely uh, stick it down. If this book page was um, thicker, I could have made this part smaller and it been a pocket on a pocket. I'm not gluing uh, right at the bottom because it's a little bit longer. So it's going to hang, hang down. So I don't want glue right at the bottom. I'm going to try and centralise that. Oops. Okay, I'm put my glasses back on because I can't see. See a thing. Yeah. Then I could probably put some, some lace across across there or some rick rack. I was gonna say some zigzag. Well it is zigzag, isn't it? So that's that. And I'll do the other side. And because this is thin uh, book page, I'm gonna put paper um, on the other side to give it some stability and the other side was a little bit boring I, I liked this inside part with the is it a list of abbreviations yeah yeah okay. so place that Oh, is this too wide? I didn't look at the um, width. Oh my goodness. What a silly billy. So I'm going to have to cut it uh, down. Because I'm, I'm not planning on doing uh, a big a big journal for, <coughs> for this project. So let me cut it, cut it down, and then I'll just have to glue um, those those sides back back down. Oh, I've been so good as well, making sure that um, they fit. I think because it looked as if it was the right. Oh, it's totally down anyway, isn't it? What am I thinking? It's this bit that isn't. I was thinking I needed to glue the card back down. Okay. I told you that um, my head was, was crazy. Oh. I've got some bread. I'll have to have some toast. And I've got some cereals. But I normally have, um, I think I'm going to cut that off the bottom. Um, I normally have banana and a cereal <coughs> bar. Um, and I always have the same breakfast. I never used to eat breakfast. Um, I never felt hungry in the mornings. So I started having a banana and a cereal bar because it was easy. Um and I didn't mind <laughs> eating it. So I've kind of got used to it. So that's that, <coughs> which actually looks better. So I've pulled um, some of the kit page from uh, the gentleman kit, and I would like to get the gentleman on it. So if I put that there. <coughs> that 
okay. So I've got one more after this one to do. Yeah, as if it was going to be, be the right height. <clears throat> Let's just take, take a little bit more off if I can get it in. If it's not straight now, nah, it's staying as is. Yeah, that's fine. I can uh, fill in with something, or I'll link all, all around and just have a little um, border type thing. And then the other side, I will have um, some of this. How big will I want it? Or well, not very at all. Not there. That down. Okay. I'll do it the same, the same size. I don't know how long um, the first video was because obviously it cut out. Um, but I've only got this to cover, and then the next um, ones. Oh, it is quick. It's very quick, actually. Okay. I'm just going to pause a second. Okay, I'm, I'm back. Right, let's, um, let's get this on. Okay, I'm going to use the uh, Kalal because it'll um, just run quicker. So make sure I've got the edges. Okay, and we'll pop that down there. Okay, luckily we're not on the crease, so that should should help out. So we'll pop, pop that down. Very wonky way, isn't it? But that's fine. Let me pull this down a little bit. Okay, so I'll just use use the ink to to blend it, blend it in. Okay. I'll just <clears throat> use the uh, 
spray on it just to make sure it's all done. Hey, I hope I've put this on the right, <laughs> right, right way. Yeah. <laughs> and then I'll fold it um, like so. So yeah, that's ended up making a small, small page, which is fine. So that's the front, and we've got two pockets, and then uh, the back. So that's that one, and the final one. So I've got these two uh, frames, which I've cut out and um, obviously left um, together. So I'm just going to ink ink around the opening and the perimeter. I'm using Vintage Photo. There's lots of frames um, in the Gentleman uh, kit. Let's go around here because there's lots of uh, photos in it. Okay, so I'm going to fold it in half. Like so. Okay, good. Press down. Then I'm going to put some um, acetate in it. And I want to stay. I wonder if this would fold actually because it is very thin um, acetate. I'm going to try it. Um, so I'll use the, the beacon because you're not going to see um, this side. Um, yeah. So if I go all the way around and do some of the the middle okay and then if I lay this over over the top and hopefully get it that that side doesn't need cutting and this side, that's fine. Let's give it a good, a good squidgle, squidgle down. Hopefully that will, will fold. This is very, very thin um, acetate. I don't know if it's um, less than <clears throat> 100 GSM, but it's probably the thinnest I've ever I've ever had, which I suppose is good, you know, in, in some ways. It'll be good if it does fold. So we'll just leave it a minute or two. <coughs> Let's um, put those away. I'm going to keep, keep that out to, to glue it on. Yeah. Put that one away. So let me get my uh, page page out. They can go back in. Oh, sorry about the the glare. That's my thingy page. I ought to keep that because I keep keep having to fold um, a new one. Put that back up there. Right. That should be. Um, okay, so I'm just going to start by just pinching it softly, just to get a bend going. Bone folder. 
and I'm really pressing, pressing down. Yeah, that's folded fine. Oh, lovely. Right, I can see that um, I went up a bit over the, over the top. Um, I don't need the ink anymore because that's I don't know if it was shining or not. Um, this page is very nicely uh, patinaed. So I'm going to put this um, at the edge of, of the page. So like that. And then it's a pocket. I mean, you could just totally uh, glue it uh, down. I could have stuck something, I suppose, there. Uh, but now I'm going to use it, use it as a pocket. So <clears throat> I need a finish. Oh, Tanya. Finish line down there and down there and down this side. And across across the bottom. side but yeah you could have definitely um just just stuck it on and not had it as a as a pocket just as you know something something to to look at right let me make sure that um the corner is is right on the on the edge There we go. So that is that page. Lovely. Oh, right. Let's have a quick look at um, what we've what we've done. So we've got that one with our uh, frames on it. We've got this one with our uh, pocket on it. This one, oh, which is stuck, <laughs> which uh, flips open like so, like that. Okay, we've got this one with a big corner pocket and then with some pages at the back. This one, we've just got a little pocket, uh, a wonky pocket at the front. And this one where we've got a pocket or side tuck. Uh, we've got some decoration there. And we've got that one there. So that was a, a triple uh, page. So, oh, I enjoyed that. Even though um, I, I was a bit potty <laughs> today. Um, I'm going to go and get some toast now before I need to need to get out so thank you very much for for joining me today um and yeah i think we'll be starting to make some um you know proper projects um you know um i'm not going to say journals i think i'm going to make folios but we'll see um so yeah um that's it i'm going <laughs> thank you very much bye for now